Hi, I'm Faiza Abdi, and welcome to AI Boost Bites, where every week we teach you the skills to supercharge your marketing with AI. Have you ever been swamped with multiple projects and suddenly received an urgent request to pull some data? Gemini can come to the rescue. A common misconception is that you need technical skills to use Gemini. But I'm about to let you in on a secret that allows me to pull data in under two minutes, no technical or coding background required. You don't even need to know how to write sheet formulas. Let's go through an example together and see how this works. Step one, understand the task and familiarize yourself with the sheet. Today, I'm trying to track our attendee company list in the GES tab versus our target company lists, which are in the LCS Now and YouTube Now tabs. I want Gemini to help create a script that will compare these lists and indicate whether they match with a yes or a no. I have blurred out any confidential parts of the sheet and have familiarized myself with the tabs and the columns where the data is located. And now I'm ready to write a prompt. Step two, write a clear prompt outlining the task as if you were explaining it to a colleague. Here I've written, please write an app script for Google Sheets that compares column D of the LCS Now tab and column H of the GES tab. And depending on whether the names match, put yes or no in column I of the GES tab and label the column LCS Now. Repeat this process for YouTube Now and compare column D of the YouTube Now tab and column H of the GES tab. And depending on whether the names match, put yes or no in column J of the GES tab and label the column YouTube Now. Double check that everything is spelled correctly and that the prompt is super clear. The better your input, the better your output will be. Step three, copy the script. Open the app script editor in your Google Sheet and paste it into the box. So let's start by copying the script and let's go back to our sheet. Click the extensions tab, then app script. Remove any existing code and paste in our script. Step four, before we can run the script, we need to name the project and save it. Now let's name the project. I'll call it now check, then we'll save the code. Step five, time to let the magic happen. Select run. Since this is our first time using app script in this sheet, we'll need to authorize it. The execution begins and you'll know it's complete when you see execution completed. And now if I come back to my original sheet, my columns have been populated. Feel free to then take some artistic liberties and make any edits required to make the data look better. And now it's your turn. Thanks for watching.